The Senior Staff Association of Electricity and Allied Companies Union has called on the federal government to wield the big stake on non-performing electricity generation and distribution companies. President of the union, Dr. Chris Okonkwo, while attributing corruption for underperformance in the sector, said government must live up to its responsibility and provide adequate oversight. Our correspondent, Amadine Uyi, reports. The privatization of Nigeria's power sector in 2013. Nigeria's power generation has continued to hover between 3,000 and 5,000 megawatts of electricity. This has definitely been below expectations and not showing any significant improvement in the sector, many see as key to Nigeria's economic development. While several reasons have been ascribed as being responsible for the frustrating underperformance of electricity distribution and generation nationwide, the Senior Staff Association of Nigeria and allied companies think corruption is key. Corruption in the context of the power sector comes from one discourse. They are supposed to collect money for everybody. But they will collect money, they don't need the whole money to where you should be with it. And the whole sector is not dependent on what they offer, what they declare. A chat with some Nigerians in Abuja on the current power situation reveals many remain frustrated over the lack of power for domestic and business use. They say the continued excuses by electricity companies are untenable, urging them to produce results. There seems to be a kind of, uh, uh, what I say, contradictory information as to what the Genko are generating and as to what the disco are really getting or maybe making available by the uh, Genco to the disco for disco to be distributed. Because the, uh, the dis disco will make it uh, look to us as if the generating sector are not really generating enough for them to be able to distribute. I wouldn't say they should be sanctioned. At least they, they could be encouraged and uh, whatever are their challenges for them not to have been able to give us steady supply, it should be looked into and uh, properly addressed. Also the president of the Senior Staff Association of Electricity and Allied Companies, Dr. Chris Okonkwo, thinks if government does not wield the big stick, there will be no changes in Nigeria's current power situation. If nobody can call anybody to her, and finish the sanction if necessary. That is the right the sanction to, to the last point, so that others will learn that nothing will change. With the recent decision by the House of Representatives to probe the power sector reforms over non-performance, Nigerians will be hoping that there will be an improvement in the sector. Amadine Uyi, Plus TV Africa.